to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be reviewing a dog dryer. This one is from Pet and F. This dryer has a strong noise control, so it's perfect if your dog is skittish with loud noises. Um, this dryer works really well, especially with Coda. He normally gets skittish when it comes to loud noises like dryers, but this one he works really well with. The dryer itself is lightweight and it's very easy to use. So the dryer does come with four different nozzles, which I really like because it doesn't just give you one nozzle and then you don't have other options to choose from. The four nozzles are the wide flat nozzle and this is more for dogs with heavy coats or just a heavy coated area in general. Um, this one works really well with Coda because he has a double coat so I tend to gravitate towards this nozzle more. The second one is the flat nozzle and this is for partial drying. For your dog so if you're just trying to dry them up really quick in certain spots and call it a day this is perfect for that one the third nozzle is a combing nozzle and this one is specifically for grooming and the last nozzle the fourth nozzle is the round nozzle and this one is for making your dog's coat extra fluffy i do like to use this one as well because i like coda to have that very fluffy fur so i tend to gravitate towards this one as well the hose that the nozzles attach to is 73 inches long, which is amazing. Especially if you have a bigger dog, you need more space to work with. So I can appreciate that the hose can reach to a certain length in order for me to groom my dog as necessary. The hose is also flexible, puncture resistant, and double reinforced. So it's nice and sturdy. So depending on your dog, whether it's a extra small dog or all the way up to an extra large dog, the time frame for drying your dog can either be between 10 minutes to an hour. So like I said, it depends on the size and also the type of fur that your dog has. For Coda, he's a husky. He has a lot of fur. It takes him about 25, maybe 30 minutes to dry completely. The dryer does come with a handle, so that is very convenient if you want to move the dryer around from different rooms and all that. It's easier to manage by grabbing onto that handle. It also has a power switch so that way you can turn the dryer on and off and it comes with a heat switch so you can use it with cold air or you can use it with hot air which i really like that there's two different settings for that so for the heat setting it can go from 85 degrees fahrenheit all the way to 131 degrees fahrenheit so it gets pretty hot the jog dryer has adjustable speeds and it goes from 56 miles per hour all the way to 145 miles per hour so it's pretty powerful and it can dry up pretty much any dog and like i said coda does have a thicker fur and the dryer works amazing on him. Another benefit from the dryer is that it cuts grooming time in half. It used to take me a long time to do Coda because I would have to shower him and dry him up. And with this dryer, it takes way less time to dry him than it would when I would towel dry him. It also has an anti-skid device on the bottom of the dryer. So your dryer isn't going to move around all over the place. It'll sit still in one spot. Because when you're drying your dog, you don't want the dryer itself to be moving around all over the place so i really like that it has that anti-skid bottom to it i absolutely love this dryer especially the color it's a nice baby blue color and i'm a sucker for that color because coda is a husky of course so he's got the blue eyes so it kind of goes with the vibes i will be leaving their instagram handles right here on the screen and on top of that i'm going to be leaving their instagram handles on the description down below and check that out Definitely want to follow them. They're an amazing brand. And on top of that, I will be leaving the direct link to the blow dryer in the description as well. So that way all you can do is just click it. It'll take you directly to the dryer and you can get one for yourself. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe. And until next time, I will see you on my next video. Bye guys.